Yeah, I did, yeah. Yeah, I did tell her that too. Yeah, I told her. Yes, I did too. I told her that. No, I was there. Yeah, I did. Yes, I did do tell her that. I did, yeah, I did tell her. I told her right to her pink haired face. Yes, I did. Yep. <laughs> I see you come up to me, you take my poetry book, and, and you take a fire to it, you throw it on the ground, stomping out like you say you're gonna do. I looked, no, look, I looked her right in the eye, dude. I looked her right in the eyeball, slid down with my gaze down into her ear canal, and I said to her, you take my poetry book, I'm gonna throw you and your little witch hat out in the creek. You and your body both. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. I did. I did do that! No. Yes, I did! Fred, do you think you could uh, carry me to the set? Absolutely. This was one of the more stranger ones. And I think uh, Sly and I were talking about uh, spooky things that have happened uh, in, our, in our time on Earth. And I immediately walked to the store, and this is completely by coincidence. I walked to the bridge, which I have mentioned, and every time I'm underneath the bridge, I don't know if it's like a, a survival tactic, but I always cross the street underneath the bridge. So I cross the street underneath the bridge and I don't even notice at first, but I'm walking and I see out of the corner of my eye, a person coming this way. And I don't particularly like to see other people walking in the middle of the night because I've done it so many times in the times that I lived in Austin and the, and the neighborhoods that I have to live in because low-class wretch but anyway I see her and she is standing facing the other side of the street so she's not moving she's not coming towards me she's not going away from me she's standing looking this way so I just keep walking and I every once in a while I shoot a little whoop, whoop, I shoot a little feeler out there I don't know if you can see my eyes moving but I keep I, I keep her in check I keep her I keep looking at her and I'm walking by and walking by and finally I get to where we're per perpendicular. We're perpendicular. She's looking directly at me and I finally look and I, she catches my eye because I see her head turn slightly to catch my gaze. So I say, fuck it. I turn and I stop and I, I don't quite, well, I don't quite stop, but I take like a little side step like this and I turn my full body to her. And as I do, she mouths something. I can't hear because I always have my headphones on, music playing or not. I always have my headphones on. And she mouths something and then gives me a little wave. And I just keep going by and she doesn't move. There's gotta be a better way to contact me. <laughs> 